Hi, I'm Mark from Sounds in Sync. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can use Eddy Load to create a sync sound edit list. That is a list that can be used to conform or assemble your location web files to get the sync sound for every shot in your film or video production. So this can be helpful when the picture editor has laid up alternate dialogue takes for on-screen dialogue, or if for some reason there is no sync sound for particular shots and you want that sync sound to be able to sync up your alternate takes of location dialogue or to sync up um, ADR recordings. So let's have a look and see how Ediload can create one of these lists. So here I've got a picture EDL for a reel of a feature film and uh, what these EDLs need is the scene and take information in the clip name column and at the moment this roll name column here points to the camera rolls and what we want to do via this process is update this to uh, contain the sound roll so that it can conform to those location web files. So in order to do that we open up the web file list window and we drop our location web files onto that. So for this process uh, our location web files um, require that uh, each file contains the scene and take information and also the sound roll metadata. And then the last thing that this process requires is that the sound recordist use the same time code that was used in the camera so that the sound files and video files have the same timestamps. Now if your production has all those things in place then all you need to do is click this export ALE file button which creates a avid log exchange file and we'll just save that to the desktop and we'll just close the web file list window and then we can drop this ALE file onto the main window. Now here we can just accept the defaults uh, for the text encoding and the delimiter character. And so here it's just saying how many clips it's found in the ALE file and do we want to apply it to the edit list. And here it's just matching the scene and take information in the ALE file with the clip name information in the edit list and it's going to pull out the sound roll names that were in the ALE file and plop them into the roll name column. And for the events that it didn't find a match for it'll just uh, leave the roll name blank. So here 457 events of 464 uh, were matched. And so here you can see most of the events have got a, now a sound roll name uh, in the roll name column and the events that didn't find a match like obviously the title info card and your leaders um, there is no sound location sound file for that. So now all you need to do is conform or assemble your location web files using the setter list. Now if you haven't done this process before check out the video that's linked in this overlay for a complete demonstration on how to do that process. But for now we'll just speed through this whole process so you can see what this list creates. So here you can see for the majority of the shots in this reel, it's actually a very long film reel, it runs 35 minutes long and I know there's uh, a few MOS shots here but the majority of the sound has been uh, conformed up so now you've got the sync sound practically for every shot in this film reel and you haven't had to get editorial to export special AEFs with the sync sound for each shot, you can just do it all yourself. So that concludes this demonstration on how to use Ediload to create a sync sound edit list. If you haven't tried out Ediload for yourself, either on Mac OS or Windows, just head to the download page of our website. Once the app is installed, just run it and click try to activate a trial license.